Welcome back to Boiler Bites. Did you know that the head of a straight pin is about 1 million nanometers across? This is the scale that scientists are working at today to engineer new materials with life-changing impact, and something that Purdue is teaching the youngest of students right here in Discovery Park, the host site for the nationwide program known as Nano Days. Nano Days is a nationwide festival of uh, nanoscale science and engineering activities for K-12 students. So they, they learn the, the key concepts. We reached out to 30 schools across the state of Indiana. We provided an opportunity for them for free to come to Purdue University, Discovery Park, and learn all about nanoscale science and engineering. People from all over campus um, participate in Nano Days. So we require about 300 volunteers um, to run this event and they come from all disciplines. Do you think that cup's gonna overflow? Yeah. Oh my goodness! Let's see if we can stir it, can we stir it? Nanotechnology is a multi-billion dollar industry that we're gonna be seeing, or our children's children will be seeing very soon. So it's important to begin by educating the community about what it is and how we are able to manipulate at the nanoscale to create and design our own materials to do what we want them to do. We have uh, about 50 activities. Kids can come in uh, and try on uh, mock clean room garments and, and, and feel like they're actually in the clean room. Um, and then go up and see the real thing upstairs in our building. It was very, very exciting. I actually um, had some young girls that were actually over by the scented balloons area. And when we talked to them and explained to them why they were able to smell the particles through the, the interface of the balloon, you know, one of them said, oh my gosh, and she, was, she just she couldn't believe it. And we just, we captured just the look on her face and um, we can relate it to them and their family. So being able to tell someone that someone with diabetes no longer has to be pricked in the finger and that we can make sensors for them and with higher sensitivity was amazing to see the look on their face. And the nano ice cream for our little, little ones, they, they were very excited. Yeah. We get a lot of feedback from the teachers um, that want to bring these kinds of activities to their classroom and, and show their students. The first year we had about four, a little over 400 people, and this is our third year doing it, and we had over 2,000 people this year. So it's exponentially growing in size, and in the future years, who knows how, how big this event will get. 